uh, we, we want to ask forgiveness for many couples that sent to us uh, their testimonies, beautiful testimonies, but because the time we, we couldn't uh, present uh, them. Uh, the idea is that at the end, we will put everything in YouTube uh, uh, with the whole uh, uh, group of testimonies. Now we would like to introduce uh, Europe. Mike and Lynn Thomas, they are uh, directors uh, of uh, Europe for many years, and they are members too of the international board. It's a pleasure to introduce them. <laughs> Hello, we're Mike and Lynn Thomas, and we look after the work of 2 Equal 1 in Europe. We started with 2 Equal 1, and at that time it was called Marriage Ministries International, in 1995, when we attended a Married for Life course, which we thought uh, would help us as we were going to live abroad in France. In fact, that never happened, but we still did the course and really enjoyed it, and it was really life-changing. It was. <clears throat> Our marriage was happy and solid, but there was always room for improvement and the Married for Life course hugely enhanced it and we like to say that it turned our marriage from like a black and white film to a full colour film. I also really learned how to share my heart with Lynn, which has blessed us both immensely. Marilyn spent some years keeping their marriage alive and then creating and writing the courses while Mike launched them into the organisation which we now know as Two Equal One. When we first met Mike and Marilyn, this was at the International Convention in Denver in April 1999. This was exciting for me, it was my very first trip to the United States. I'd already been there a few times for work, mm -hmm. uh, but this was the first time we went together. And in fact, we've been together many times since. Mm -hmm. And uh, Mike and Marilyn have also traveled to Europe. And uh, when they were over here, they've stayed with us. They have. Um, we've been to lots of conventions in the States and we've also stayed with Mike and Marilyn several times. Sometimes with the International Board for a board meeting and sometimes on our own when we've been visiting the States for a vacation. At one international meeting I remember Marilyn made some beautiful laminated plaques for the doors with our names on them which made us feel really welcome and it also made it clear who was meant to be in which bedroom. Yeah, we've loved staying with Mike and Marilyn in their beautiful uh, mountain home and enjoyed their company very much. They're both so welcoming and they were amazing hosts. We have appreciated all the work that Marilyn has done beforehand and made time to make the trip so comfortable for us. Yeah. And also the many times that Mike collected us from the airport uh, to save us having to hire a car. We spent many hours with them sharing our hearts in their lounge and over meals together. We can see some similarities, a few similarities, between Mike and Marilyn and us, as this Mike is also a man who loves to look ahead and plan for the future, whereas me, I'm more a down-to-earth person and want to get all the details in place. We did once go to speak at an MMI event and we found the name badges Mike and Marilyn there for us. The people there had to get over their disappointment quickly when they realised they'd not got Mike and Marilyn, they'd just got Mike and Lynn. <laughs> Marilyn and Lynn have spent quite a bit of time linking up together and proofreading uh, documents to increase the quality of them and make sure they're correct. Mm. Um, I tended to spend more time chatting to Mike and discussing and thinking how the future of the ministry should be and what we could do to grow the ministry. However, Mike, uh, has a vision and Marilyn is always there to support Mike mm. and do the work necessary to bring about the vision. Mm. In earlier years Marilyn did her best to do her role and if others didn't do the role they were meant to be doing she'd do that too. In one convention she shared that she'd learned to say that's not my job. This phrase has stood me in incredibly good stead over the years because that was something I was tempted to do too. To begin with, it appeared to us that Mike was the leader who chatted to everybody and that Marilyn was very quiet. Very soon it was clear that Marilyn was a brilliant leader and teacher, although a very different person to Mike. She preferred talking one-to-one. -one. They've had to adjust throughout their married life. They've been wonderful in completing projects between them as Mike would envisage them, start them off, and then Marilyn 
would make them come to life with all the details. The Married for Life video course is a prime example of this. Last year she told the International Board that she had completed her job, created the video course, and now it was our job, not her job, to sort out how it was going to be used. In some ways, it's been her life's work in recent years. We've really admired and appreciated Marilyn for her devotion, her consistency, her dedication and her de determination to do the all God has led her to do. She was always encouraging to us and we will be forever grateful for her life and her ministry. She is a wonderful example of how to live a life for Christ. We've both enjoyed working with Marilyn over the years and it was great to see her delight when a new version, a new translation of the manual was completed in another European language, mostly recently French and then Croatian. She also so appreciated the work of the translators who were translating for the subtitles for the Married for Life course. And she always uh, gave her recognition of that and thanked people for it. Mm. And that means that it can get to more couples in the world that don't speak English. Mm. She was quick in sending her thanks often to many people and we often were encouraged mm. by uh, receiving that as we did work within the ministry. When we do the courses, we often use a small book of marriage quotes by Mike Iaconelli, and so we've adapted one of those to finish with. Two Equal One is a one-of-a-kind organisation with a one-of-a-kind mission created by a one-of-a-kind couple with a one-of-a-kind marriage originally kept alive by a one-of-a-kind woman. So thank, thank you, you Marilyn! Hi, we are Guilherme and Marina, currently living in Bournemouth. We were broke up when we decided to do two week or one for the first time in Brazil. It was such a powerful tool that God used it not only to join us, but to provide us with a completely new marriage. At the same time, we were born again and God also made us new. We are very thankful for Mike and Marilyn a ministry that helped to save our marriage and to transform our lives. Hello, this is Tina Max from Goodman. I would just want to say thank you for saving our, our life, our marriage. Thank you what this ministry has done for us. And thank you for the network all over the world. So thank you for, for being there for us. We are just so grateful that our marriage got saved 25 years ago. And I think back on all the personal talks I've had with Marilyn over the years and I loved it. I'm so grateful for everything that this ministry still does and that we can still be a part of it. And God bless you. Hi, we're Neil and Aileen Hobbs from London in England. Although we were both born again, we really struggled in the early years of our marriage. We're so grateful to you and Marilyn for your faithful obedience to God so that we could benefit from the teachings of 2 equals 1 and has helped to transform our marriage and our family. Your personal triumph, the transparency of course leaders and the godly principles we learned throughout the course has not just healed our marriage but also inspired us as a couple to be part of the bigger dream against our own limitations, fear and history so we can pass this wonderful legacy on to heal and bless many marriages, families and generations to come. Isten áldjon benneteket, Gábor és Etelka vagyunk Magyarországról. Nagyon hálásak vagyunk Merlin emlékéért, mert neki köszönhető az, hogy ő kitartóan harcolt, 
és Isten adott neki egy látást Mákkal együtt, hogy a házasságokat megmentse, és az ő kitartásának köszönhető, hogy a mi életünkbe is egy hatalmas változás jött, és az elhívásunkba beleállhattunk. És ezen keresztül nem csak Magyarországnak lett áldás, merőn, hanem Szerbiának is, és Romániának is, és így sok-sok több száz házaspár megújulhatott. Nagyon hálásak vagyunk az emlékéért, köszönjük az ő itt létét, és reméljük, hogy találkozni fogunk a mennyben, vele együtt örvendezhetünk. Isten áldjon téged, Mike, az egész családodat, áldja meg az úrbenetet.